When you think of concussions in sports, do you likely think of football, hockey, maybe even soccer? Uh, but swimmers are also ending up in hospitals with head injuries. Whether they bump into the concrete wall or hit another swimmer, hit the diving board, or maybe slip on the deck, head injuries are happening in the water. Susan Elizabeth Littlefield explains how some Minnesota entrepreneurs are tackling this problem head on. <laughs> Am I doing this? <laughs> Hold on, hold on, hold on. Pool time is typically fun time, but sometimes things get serious. I forgot there wasn't uh, flags there, so I went, and uh, at first I was like, what just happened? And then the pain came, and I jumped out of the pool, and I started falling because it hurt so bad. He isn't the only one around here who's had a concussion in the water. It hurt like heck. So her dad, who is also a coach, got to thinking. She has like concussion. And, um, and I was like, what do I have to do to get you guys to do the backstroke right? Get your helmet? Swim mom and manufacturing professional Teresa Finn was standing by, and the two put their heads together. There you go. Good. To protect the heads of others. It's called a hammerhead cap. It's shaped like the human head, so it's larger in the back and smaller in the front. They use what they call honeycomb impact technology. The, the whole goal is it's a mission to protect athletes and we're starting with swimmers because really there's a gaping hole in head protection for them. Just ask Paralympian and St. Kate's swim coach Justin Zook. This is a really unique way to address a problem and meet a large need I think in the sport. And this Minnesota born Olympic gold medalist is also a fan. He spent the morning joining a photo shoot for the product. Swimming is a huge part of my life and yeah I am putting my name behind it because you know I believe in it. You know I have a, a five and seven year old daughter that are both starting to swim and you know want to keep them safe. Production is sailing forward. Caps are on pre-sale for fall. A mission to protect their heads and their fun. Susan Elizabeth Littlefield, WCCO 4 News. The founders hope that because this technology is so aerodynamic it could one day work into other sports like baseball, football and even hockey. How about that? That's great. Kind of a clever idea, yeah, right? Yeah, it is. Yeah, hope it works.